Hello all, welcome to another episode of GitHub Copilot. Today's episode focus on Copilot in action. Let us see how we can leverage the power of Copilot for developing a simple web page using HTML and CSS. I'm using VS Code and the same approach can be used by other IDs as well. We have a blank index.html and styles file. So let us start with the copilot. I'll start with a landing page definition. So I'm asking copilot define a professional landing page for my website. So I need a professional landing page. Use the dark purple and black as theme. I defined the theme. I'm not stopping there. I'm starting saying include navbars for navigation to different areas. Uh, maybe the home or the other home, contact, etc. I'm not giving all the list. Um, let them add, let Copilot add some of the navigation. And now the main page will have one section with left side text and right side image. So I'm forcing my landing page as a single section with a one big image and the left side with the sum of the text. Let the text portion have title, explanation, few buttons like trial, buy, etc. So if you feel something else is triggered, you can start explaining that as well. But this is my requirement in a very rough manner. I pass the requirement. I need one a landing page with these are the requirements kind of thing. So let us see how it's defined. Now it's defined only the CSS this time. Suggest the HTML code for the above style sheet. So I haven't asked for HTML explicitly. So it's came with only the CSS. Now it's coming with HTML as well. Now we have HTML and CSS. So I'm going to the HTML, pass this data. And next I will be in the styles area, pass this one. So I have styles.css, which is imported here as part of HTML. Both looks fine. Now let us go ahead and explore this look first. I'm going to run it in a live preview. So this is what it came right now. As we mentioned, we have the navbar with the logo and the areas and some text in the left side and there is an image in the right side. So let me just add some existing image for the right side so i just replacing this url with one of the image url and looking at how it looks now it looks this way and for example i need few icons here this home about services and all so let me go back to copilot and improve this area so i'm just asking this uh, side needs to be improved with uh, Favag icons add reference to fab icons and add appropriate icons for the navbar links. So all the links needs to have its own icons. That is what I am looking at. So let us see how it's going to modify. It's added the link to fab icons and added the fab icons here. So let us replace this code with the new code and just save it. Hope it's defined the CSS. Looks great. So now this is what the output is. You can see the five icons are updated here. 
each of them but the new one is not taken care by this url so i just need to replace the url again url of my image so let us go ahead and replace this one save it now our web application looks this way so here i need one title as well instead of this one let me ask copilot to add a title here replace logo with a small fab icon and title of my page uh, for example my page is ai driven web app so that's the name i needed so it needs to replace this area let me directly replace it and going ahead to refresh it yeah looks like our page is defined the title is came here with icons and everything and the left side with the text with the two buttons trial and buy and a purple colored uh, uh, theme is used overall black and purple and i have replaced the image links this looks fine so let us try one more example how we can define a little more complex detailed page let us clear the html and css timing so it's a blank html and css starting with a new communication i have a predefined prompt for creating a little more complex page so let me just pass it out to copilot it's again similar kind of prompt where we defined each of the section as a nav bar with a uh, following areas so as you can observe here my company is already enforced the public code filtering because of that i won't be able to proceed further the code which is generated by copilot as it's a generic requirements the code exists in one or the other public repositories and it's got blocked so i am just changing my model to 01 preview so this is the new support provided by copilot it's in private preview right now those who received the access may notice this area where you can have select your own models based on your requirements so 40 is blocked i'm going to a new model 01 that is gpt 40 sorry gpt 01 preview and passing exactly the same prompt as there is no public code filtering applied for this model i'm expecting the code should be returned back to me and here also i'm looking for a website with uh, some headings and a middle portion and a footer area there are three sections uh, four sections in this case there is a carousel section also i am requesting copilot to generate it total four sections should come as part of the design so let us see how the copilot is going to render this particular website the html is came and obviously the css is also start coming here and we used some other theme in this case um, black and blue theme is used here so let us add this html and going ahead and adding the css and let us preview this new website here goes the new website where you have a title portion you have a middle area where the image carousel image should be there we will replace now and the cards with the four blocks and there is a footer area that is what we requested now we will start replacing one or the other things now first one is carousel image let us replace this carousel image i just replaced this one but as it's replaced it may looks it may be using the complete size of the image as you can see the image is very big and it's replaced the entire area so let us take here also the support of copilot let me just select this one and request copilot make the image 
height appropriate for a carousel. So I'm planning to add some more images and make it as a carousel format. So let me see how Copilot can suggest me some height differences uh, that will help me. So there is a height uh, CSS adjustment is done. So let me go ahead and see there are two things already exist. It needs to be replaced. I did the replacement. Now our website looks this way. So there is a title and carousel with a, some text on top of that and four different cards. So if you want the data for each of these cards, I can just replace the images and add it. And there is some links at the bottom. And for example, this friends of Coco Palette or the success message, I need to arrange to the left centered or left side arranged into the left side. So let me see how to do this. I can just select this particular one, specify that, um, rearrange this message to left aligned. Each of these small things, instead of we remembering the styles and CSS constrained HTML areas, my requirements I am communicating to Copilot in a natural language so that Copilot needs to help me to arrange it. So this one I am going to replace it. So let us see how it turned out now. So you can see it's moved to the left side and there is a highlighting portion is given. If I want to remove that one, that also fine. I can say revise the recommendation. What are the revision is required? Make the text big, white colored. So this is what I needed. So it revised the previous suggestion on carousel's text position should be absolute left aligned and all but change the sum of the elements that font size and everything so let me replace and see how it looks right now so you can see that it's a uh, move to this side and uh, if i need some change here i can do that one but overall this is what my web page looks like in a fraction of a second, I am able to create this web page. That's a starting step for any web development. And one more thing we will do, the header. I need the friends of Copilot to be left aligned, the remaining right aligned. Most of the time, it's a little difficult to play around with um, CSS to make in the same line. Some elements are left aligned and some elements are right aligned. So let us try how we can do it. Uh, make h1 left aligned and nav right aligned also add fav icon reference and fav icons for nav links so let us see how it is going to help me with this requirement i need this h1 my heading to be left aligned but navigation should be right aligned along with that some fav icons needs to be added for highlighting this links normally we keep small icons to get a highlight on the navigation bar so it's able to add the styles so either i can replace everything or this much area is what it suggested. So let me just replace. Rest of the content is there. So no need for that. And it's uh, given some changes in my style. There is a header change. I hope there is a header on this. Header H1 Navar Ally. These are the things needs to be replaced. Let me just replace as it is. Even you can ask the Copilot to recreate the entire file itself. There is no need for you to check and replace kind of thing. Instead, it's uh, able to create the entire file. Now, 
you can see that the heading is left aligned the other things are right aligned with the proper icons along with this home sign in and contact so instead of we are understanding and writing all this css styles and html areas copilot is able to align with our requirement when we properly pass our requirement in a natural language this is the power of copilot utilize the power of copilot in your day-to-day -day web application development this is a simple example if you have a more complex scenarios you can leverage copilot with a proper natural language based prompt go ahead and try out this example Thank you.